And welcome back. This is Baller Scuba with an episode of Let's Play Xeno Gears. I'm joined by always by Faye, Satan, Ellie, Bot, Rico, Billy, uh, and Maria, and Choo Choo, but they're not on the list. Do you guys remember the setup for enemy number one at the first generator? We got two small gears and Solaris troops, three white knights at generator number two. Uh, generator number three has a special attack gear with a one white knight. And generator number four has a power gear and one white knight. So what I am going to do is I'm going to put Ellie on generator one, Billy on generator two, Satan on generator three, and Faye on generator four. Yes, and now he's going to repeat it to me as if I didn't just put it in. That is correct. Let's go! Please hurry and get the preparations for the battle in order. Uh, I do need to get ready. So, yeah. Unfortunately, that means I do have to talk to a choo choo. Again. Freaking choo choos. Octzen. We will defeat you. But not before I do need to uh, go back to uh, the choo choo just outside here and get some new gear parts. I will be taking care of that off screen. I'll let you know what I do. I do need to sell some stuff as well, like the, the gold nuggets and the gold bullion that we just got in the last dungeon. So I'll meet you on the other side. Alright everybody, that I need to be fully equipped is fully equipped. I did not have enough money to equip both. Uh, the steer and the brigandier. I got, I believe, one upgrade on the steer, but nothing on the brigandier. Uh, run back in here, and the enemy is almost there. Are we ready? Uh, I'm ready. Let's go. Everybody is set and ready to go, kind of, for the most part. I, I I'll probably still double check. Everybody depart. Be careful. Yes, of course. Octzen. So now we're standing on top of the generators. This can't be good for the weight on them. Okay, so generator number one is up first. This does give us an opportunity to um, equip Ellie with everything that we might need. So let's look at that. You know, she's still on the martial rod. We need to get her on... Durr down. I don't like Durr. We'll go ahead and put that on her. I will put the... Ether doubler on her because she's gonna probably be my mage from now on. Looking at her gear though, like I said, you know, HP, uh, fuel, all the upgrades I got in there. Uh, hot rod G, that needs to go away for this flare rod G. And I believe I wanna have an AR plus 5 on her instead of this light AR plus 1. And I do want a response circuit instead of the sim circuit. None of that is necessary, but she's she's been itching for an upgrade for some time now. Let's do this. I don't have anything against you, but I can't turn back now. Yes, of course. Of course. Now, all these little Solaris guards are very, very annoying, as you might expect. Their, their little Solaris guards. Which is why I brought Ellie. There's six of them, and they all get their turn in right before she does. Let's make sure they don't get another turn. Go, air rods. Over 2,000 damage and they all die. Just like I wanted. To be honest though, if you got the upgrades, these are pretty simple fights. I mean, look at that. Down goes that guy. Yeah, uh, if you really wanted, you could put a beam jammer on her, but it doesn't really matter. Um, yeah, let's do a death blow. Why not? Hard smash! I didn't really need to, but why not? You know? Why not? 
15,000 experience, and she learned Anima Wave. Um, she probably has been itching to learn that one for a while. We get two silver ARs. That's not necessarily the best thing you can get from that fight. You can get a silver AR plus one, but unfortunately I didn't get one. Uh, next one, let's do... Uh, yeah, why we get to choose that one again is beyond me. But let's go ahead and do generator number two, which I have uh, with Billy. And again, this will give us a chance to check on his equipment. Uh, his his regular equipment is good. Let's look at his gear equipment, though. Uh, Laron, uh, that can change to a 5. No, he doesn't need it. No, we're good. Uh, I only have a couple of those, so... I got them in some fights. In the last dungeon. Rest in peace, Agents of Evil. May all of you turn to dust! Yes. Here are the three white knights. I don't know if you guys remember, but I think we fought these a long ass time ago. It doesn't really matter, you know, like like I said, these fights are pretty easy. I don't want to say very easy, but they're pretty easy if you got some upgrades with the last spot. I'm just gonna do my ether attack, and down they go. That's all it takes. Just an ether attack from Billy. The square button is your friend. They haven't even done any damage to him. It doesn't even matter how fast you guys go. Because you will die with one shot and you haven't done anything to me yet. Go ahead, get two turns in for all I care. Defended. Yeah, go for it. Knock yourself out. Still no damage. What are you going to do when Billy comes for you? You're going to die. That's what you're going to do. 8400 experience. 1500 G. Next mission I want to do is, I believe I want to skip number three and just go for number four, which is Faye. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and check. Um, I don't know, when was the last time we looked at the Wild Hall's equipment? He's still got, okay, the two magnetic codes, yeah, that's the build I was going for for him. Uh, Insulate AR, that can be replaced. Oh, yeah, electric damage down by 30%. No, screw that. We're getting the AR plus 5 on the Wild Hall. Let's go! Alright, I can do it! I'm ready anytime! Unless I'm emo. Then I am not ready to fight. Oh, we've got legitimate, legitimate enemies now. Except these White Knights. White Knights are pretty much going to be fuel for my attack level because down they go with one strong attack. And then here comes the... What kind of sound is that for the avalanche? Ugh. Whatever. Down he goes. You'll notice I'm not boosting. It's not because... Uh, well, it's not because I forgot about it. It's because I don't need it. Oh no, 1800 damage. I if I did have a uh, AR repair, this would be a good time to use it because this guy has been known to sap your defense. But he's weak to Rio Bill. Which does over 2000 damage. Yeah, there we go. The Avalanche Drill defense down, but I still have 9500 HP. So I'm not too scared about it. Yeah, so another 700. You know, he's probably not going to last another 10 turns or so. Probably not even going to last another 5 turns. So, plus the magnetic coat makes me dodge all the time. So that's why Faye is here. Because it doesn't matter how much your defense goes down. If you... Holy crap, 3,000. You're lucky that... I will finish you right here, most likely. Down he goes. So that's probably the hardest fight. That one right there. Got a noise filter and uh, two light air plus ones. Nice. And see, why are they even giving me the option still? Generator number three. Let's talk to Satan and check his equipment. It's been a while since we've seen Satan. Uh, he's still in the penguin coat. I don't think I have any more. Nah. I used all that stuff, so I don't have anything to give him that's an upgrade, really. But, he should probably... Do I have anything better? 
Not really. What's the noise filter? Sonic damage down. Oh, for this fight, yes, there is a trick. Put the silver ARs that you want in the first fight on him. Uh, if you had a silver AR plus one, it'd be a lot better. I will be your opponent. Come on! Yeah, the silver AR plus ones, I believe, do uh, 50%, and this, these only do 25. But whatever. Yeah, here come the White Knights again. They're just kind of a pain in the ass or anything else. I'm going to go ahead and boost her, because why the hell not? Why not? Let's kill this guy before he gets another turn in. One strong attack and down he goes. Sonic Boom! Holy crap, 3,000 damage on a Sonic attack. Could have, I might have... I might have been able to put that noise filter on there. I didn't think he actually had a Sonic attack yet. I don't think anybody did. Alright, let's get up to level 3 on the attack level. 309 damage in. Here we go, that's what I'm used to seeing, the gel attack. Which does zero damage because I have silver ARs on. Genjin! I don't know if we ever saw that one. Oh, karate chop at the end. Judo chop, whichever one you want to use, even though I don't think judo even has chops. They're like a throwing style, whatever. Yeah, there we go. Another gel attack for zero damage because I have protection against that. Now 300 damage and another Kenjin. Will this be enough to finish him off? 